syllables. In this video, we will learn about the different types of syllables. So what is a syllable? A syllable is part of a word that contains a single vowel sound that's produced as a unit. A, E, I, O and U are vowels. A vowel is a sound that's made when air flows out of the mouth without being blocked by any part of the mouth or throat. For example, when we pronounce the letter A, no part of the mouth or throat blocks the sound. A, A. All the other letters in the alphabet are consonants as the letter sounds are made when air is partially blocked by the mouth or throat. For example, when we pronounce the letter T, T, our teeth block some of the air flowing. T, T. Each vowel has a short and a long vowel sound. A, A. E, E, I, I, O, O, U, A. Being able to identify the number of vowels in a word will help us to break down the word into different syllable sounds. Learning about syllables can help you to correctly pronounce words and with spellings. Now let's look at some examples. In this example, we hear one vowel sound, which is the short A sound. The letter C is a consonant, the letter A is a vowel, and the letter T is a consonant. So as the word only has one vowel, it also has one syllable. Cat. Dog. In this example, we hear one vowel sound which is the short O sound. The letter D is a consonant, the letter O is a vowel, and the letter G is a consonant. So as there is only one vowel in the word, it means that there is only one syllable. Dog. Coat. In this example, we hear one vowel sound which is the long O sound. The letter C is a consonant. The letters O and A make a combined long vowel sound. And the letter T is a consonant. So, the word coat has one syllable. Coat. Parrot. In this example, we hear two vowel sounds which are the short A sound and the short O sound. Parrot. The letter P is a consonant, the letter A is a vowel, the letters R are consonants, the letter O is a vowel and the letter T is a consonant. So as there are two vowel sounds in this word, it means that there are two syllables. Parrot. So in order to count how many syllables are in a word, we just need to identify the number of single vowel sounds. An easy way to work out the number of syllables in a word is to put your hand under your chin and count the number of times your jaw drops. For example, banana. So if you put your hand under your chin when you say the word banana, then you can count your jaw drop three times. Banana. So the word banana has three syllables. Let's try it with these examples. Put your hand under your chin and count the number of times your jaw drops. Cat. One syllable. Dog. One syllable. Coat. One syllable. Parrot. Two syllables. The letter Y can be a vowel or a consonant depending on how it's pronounced in the word. 
It's a consonant if the word begins with the letter Y and it makes the Y sound. For example, yellow. Yellow. So the letter Y is a consonant. U. U. The letter Y is a consonant. The letter Y is considered to be a vowel in a few different cases. The first is if the word has no other vowel. For example, Jim. Jim. The letter Y makes an I sound. My. My. The letter Y makes an I sound. The second reason the letter Y can be a vowel is when it's at the end of a word or syllable. For example, sky, sky. The letter Y makes an I sound. Candy, candy. The letter Y makes an E sound. Cycle, cycle. The letter Y makes an I sound and it's at the end of the syllable. Lastly, the letter Y is considered to be a vowel if it's in the middle of a syllable. For example, system, system. The letter Y is in the middle of the first syllable and it makes an I sound. Pyramid, pyramid. Again, the letter Y is in the middle of the first syllable and it makes an I sound. So in all of these examples, the letter Y makes the vowel sounds E or I. So an easy way to work out if the letter Y is a vowel or a consonant is to identify whether it makes a consonant sound or a vowel sound. The consonant sound is Y and the vowel sounds would either be I, I, E, or E. The word mystery has two letter Y's that make different sounds. The first letter Y is in the middle of a syllable and it makes the I sound. Therefore, it's considered to be a vowel. The second letter Y is at the end of the word and it makes the E sound. Therefore, it's considered to be a vowel. So the word mystery has three syllables as there are three vowel sounds. Miss, t, re. Mystery. There are seven types of syllables. Closed syllable, open syllable, vowel team syllable, diphthong syllable, vowel consonant E syllable, consonant LE syllable, and R controlled syllable. Closed syllable. A closed syllable ends in a consonant. This type of syllable is called closed because the vowel is closed in by at least one consonant. The vowel in the word has a short vowel sound. For example, pig. This word consists of the consonant P, the vowel I, which makes an I sound, and the consonant G. The short vowel I is closed in by the consonant G. Bed. The short vowel E is closed in by the consonant D. Red. The short vowel E is closed in by the consonant D. Hen. The short vowel E is closed in by the consonant N. Open syllable. An open syllable ends in a vowel. This type of syllable is called open because there are no other consonants after the vowel. The vowel has a long vowel sound. For example, 
she. This word consists of the consonants s, h, and the long vowel e. She. As you can see, there are no other consonants after the vowel. Fly. This word consists of the consonants f and l. The letter y is considered a vowel because it makes the long vowel sound i. Fly. We. This word consists of the consonant w and the long vowel e. We. Go. This word consists of the consonant G and the long vowel O. Go. Vowel team syllable. A vowel team syllable consists of two vowels next to each other that make one sound. So the vowels work together as a team to make one long vowel sound. This is usually the first vowel sound and the second is silent. This rule applies to the vowels AI, IE, EA, AY, OA, EE, and OE. For example, rain, rain. The vowels in this word are A and I. These vowels work together to make the long A sound and the letter I is silent. Pi Pi In this word, the vowels are I and E. They work together to make the long vowel sound I. Leaf Leaf the vowels in this word are E and A. They work together to make the long vowel sound E. Hey. Hey. The vowels in this word are A and Y. They work together to make the long vowel sound A. Boat. Boat. The vowels in this word are O and A. They work together to make the long vowel sound O. Tree. Tree. The vowels in this word are E. They work together to make the long vowel sound E. Toe. Toe. The vowels in this word are O and E. These vowels work together to make the long vowel sound O. An easy way to remember this rule is that when two vowels go walking, then the first does the talking. So the first vowel in a vowel team syllable will be pronounced as a long vowel sound and the second vowel stays silent. Diphthong syllable. A diphthong syllable has two vowels next to each other that make a combined vowel sound. This is different from a vowel team syllable because in a diphthong syllable, both vowels are pronounced making a combined vowel sound. This applies to the letters a u, a w, o o, e w, o i, o y, o u, and O W. Although the letter W is not usually a vowel, in some combinations it makes the same combined vowel sound. A U and A W make the same OR sound. For example, author, author, saw, saw. O O and E W can make the same oo sound. For example, food, food, chew, chew.
OO can also make the short U sound. For example, foot. OI and OY can make the same OI sound. For example, coin, coin, boy, boy. OU and OW make the same OW sound. For example, house, house, cow, cow. Vowel consonant E syllable. Vowel consonant E syllables are also called the magic E. This is because the word consists of a silent letter E and a long vowel sound. For example, win, win. This is an example of a closed syllable as it consists of a short I vowel sound closed in by the consonant N. However, if we add the letter E to the end of the word, then the letter E is silent and the vowel makes a long I vowel sound. Wine. Win. Wine. Another example is can. This is an example of a closed syllable because the short vowel A is closed in by the consonant N. However, if we added the letter E to the end of the word, then the E would be silent and the vowel A would make a long A vowel sound. Cane. Can. Cane. Now let's go through some more examples. Cake. Snake. Home. Kite. So in these examples, the letter E is silent and the vowels A, O and I make the long vowel sounds. Consonant LE syllable. The consonant LE syllable consists of a consonant followed by the letters LE. The letters LE make an O sound. For example, Table, table, puzzle, puzzle, candle, candle, turtle, turtle. Our controlled syllable, an our controlled syllable consists of at least one vowel followed by the letter R. The letter R controls the vowel and changes the way it's pronounced. This occurs with the combinations AR, ER, IR, OR and UR. For example, star, star. Her, her, bird, bird, fork, fork, yogurt, yogurt.